Cyberpunk 2077 publisher CD Projekt Red has thrown some shade at fellow publisher Ubisoft and its failed attempt to label Skull and Bones as a 4A game. AAA is usually a label given to blockbuster games by big money companies to signify that yes, these games were expensive to make. As a label, it's basically meaningless. At best, it gives you some idea of a game's budget, and at worst, it's marketing jargon used to convince gamers that a game that costs more will be better. Earlier in the year, Ubisoft CEO Yves Guillemont called Skull and Bones a 4A release to justify its $70 price tag. And now, in a recent Q and a CD Projekt Red's Investor Relations VP Carolina Nass was jokingly asked whether the studio would reassess its AAA-only stance amid Ubisoft's comments. Ours will be 5A, Nass responded. So if Skull and Bones marked the first 4A game in history and CD Projekt Red dares to unleash the world's first 5A game with The Witcher 4, who's going to pick up the challenge, write the check and dare develop the first 6A game?